So we're playing, this is round two for Crusade of Fire at 1,000 points, because Jim didn't tell us if we had to play two. And uh, on here we've got two squads of cultists with lots of cultists. Yeah, one squad of 10. Oh, uh, one squad of 10. One squad of 20. Yep. Plague Marines and Rhinos. Five with two Meltas, seven with two Plasmas. A bombs. bunch of spawn, one Hellbrute. A uh, Lord? Uh, yes. A Lord with Nurgle Mark? Sorcerer on a bike, Mark of Nurgle. Ah, Sorcerer, Mark of Nurgle. So he doesn't make the Nurgle guys troops, that was the issue. And a Defiler. And then on my side I've got two Soul Grinders, a Bloodthirster, a Corn Cannon, a group of Plague Bears with a upgraded uh, Plague Ridden, two Heralds of Zinch, and a squad of uh, Nurglings. And uh, those guys aren't really here. Neither is that Land Raider. And uh, we've already put down objectives, so five, six, one, two, four, three. And it is not night fighting. And it's the deadlock, so we're starting with six objectives and counting down. And we, we, we roll one, we cannot draw one, we cannot achieve, we just redraw. So his warlord causes soul blaze, and mine took a tactical and I got lead by example. So uh, that's, that's a good one, I think. Alright, I did not seize, and he's got secure objective 3, secure objective 1, hold the line, secure objective 1, supremacy, and secure objective 4. His movement is done, and so he, he comes up. These guys are going to be able to grab that objective unless they roll really poorly on a run. You got psychers? Yes. Yes, so there's a psychic phase. Force is denied. Well, I denied his force, but these guys have been enfeebled, and then he's on to running where those guys are going to claim the objective with a three inch run. Shooting phase, nothing happens, and in his assault phase, uh, you can't really assault because those guys ran. Yep. All right, moving on to demons, round one. But how many points did you get? Point one, one, two. Wow. Uh, three units in my scoring unit, and none in none of yours. Yep. So three. Three. You said three uh, so far. Victory point if you have objective number one. I got three ones. Four. Oh, there it is. Three. So First three. Objective three. Objective three was uh, one there. Okay, so I did not get three. Control D3 if you have two objectives, at least twice as many as your opponent. Uh, I got one. I have two. You have two. You have three. So, All right, so how many points is it? Two. Two. So there's four. Four. Objective marker four. Four. Four, got it. All right, you got five points in? Wow, it's five to zero, but this is round one, so we'll see what happens. We've got secure objective one, five, big game hunter, supremacy, recon, and objective two. So movement phase is done, and I immobilize that rhino with a bloodthirster. And now we're on to psychic's phase, where there's a total of six dice plus my two psychers, and we're on to psychic mumbo jumbo. Psychics is done, nothing happened. He denied the witch because he's got that biker lord, it looks like, typhus. Uh, and we're on to, uh, on to shooting. Where Warpstorm says... Six. So, on my turn, I wreck this thing using a lot of shooting. Um, getting myself big game hunter for that and first blood. I hold objective one because I've got an objective denying swarm unit and objective five. So I got, uh, let's see, first blood, which is one. Two points for taking out a vehicle. Three points for objective five. Four points for that thingamajigger. And... Supremacy, D3 if you hold at least two objective markers and twice as many as your opponent. So I got one, two, two, three. I have two. Two. I do not have twice as many as you, so... Oh well. Alright, so that remains there then. And do I want to drop one of them? Where's objective two? I'm going to drop objective two. And we're done. On to round two. So you can have a total of five now. So you got secure objective three, demolitions. You want to redraw that one because that's the blow up the building. Secure objective four, five, and hunger for glory. And the last one is five again. All right, his movement. These guys are here. He's moved. That d defiler does a little bit of shifting. These guys are coming to try to get that objective, which they might be able to do. 
and uh, we're on to psychics. We rolled two, so we both have four dice. Denied his force weapon both terms, and Plague Wind or Enfeeble or whatever didn't go off, and so we're on to shooting. Shooting is done, and he killed two Nurglings. Bases. And uh, put a wound on the Bloodthirster with a melted gun in the air. We're, uh, yeah, that's an unlikely event. And um, I did not fall out of the sky, and so we're on to the assaults. Assault, he uh, kills my Plague Bearers before they even get to swing, and uh, wins a challenge, getting nothing for it. Uh, because it's an unworthy offering, but gets points. So you issued a challenge and a bunch of other stuff. So he is at nine points to my four on round two. And we'll see where it goes for, for Demon. All right, I got Supremacy, Objective 6, 4, Hold the Line, and Objective 6 again. It's going to be hard to do. Nearly impossible. All right, and I got nothing in reserve, so on to movement. My movement is done. He's there. He doesn't move far. Hanging out. That's my warlord. Hanging out, twitched a little bit. That Bloodthirster's in hover mode. He actually flies off the table, but Vector strikes that tank uh, with a nine that does nothing. So, on to Psychics, where there are three dice. Nothing happens in the Psychic phase, so on to shooting. Shooting phase, they lose one dude. And uh, there was a lot of shooting. I glanced that Hellbrute with, uh, with the corn cannon and um, killed a whole bunch of dudes here and blinded them. And now I'm charging and you... I didn't blind them. They passed. Okay. I tried. To, I threw a lot of blinding grenades. I did a wound with the strength one grenade. Oh, wait. Your toughness five. Six. I did not wound you. Your wound goes back. Um, but I got a six inch charge. So he took a, a hull point, but he did two wounds to the spawn. They can't instant kill him because they're toughness six. And other than that, there are no other assaults. And so uh, we're, we are where we are. So let's see what I got point wise. Secure objective six? No. Secure objective four? No. Um, hold the line if I got three scoring units. I do. And uh, supremacy if, scored, if I hold at least two objectives and twice as many as you do, I do not hold twice as many as you do, without a doubt. Because you hold two. Yeah, and I got one. Two. I got two, so, yep. So, I got one point that turn. And I could discard one, and I might. Alright, so we got objective three, big game, harness the warp, and kingslayer. And that's Pinky the King. So his movement is done, locked. These guys are coming up to kill some nurglings, and he moved his flamer into range. Moved, 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 moved. And we're on to, uh... Psychic. Psychic. He activated his force weapon. I almost denied it. It was so close, but he's going to get a point for that. He can't use it because it's Soul Grinder, but he's still got it. He didn't roll two sixes or anything, right? No. Bummer. Oh, well. So much for the demons. They're not happy. All right, then we're on to the shooting. He failed to kill my warlord with his battle cannon. Shooting way over here instead. And uh, I think you're done, right? I got uh, two uh, plasma, uh, plasma guns. Okay. One gets hot and dies and felt pain. The other guy didn't do anything. All right, there's one last plasma. And now we're on to assault. Build another spawn and I'm um, down two hull points. And I'm immobilized. So uh, he's hit me on my rear armor now, which means the spawn can actually hurt me. And we're on to demons. Round three, uh, round two, sorry. Is this round two? This is round three. Uh, round three. Uh, how many points did you score? Three. You got a total of one point, so he's up to ten. Ten to five on round three. And so here's what happens. He's locked in combat. He flies on, walks over to here. These guys could have scuttle. He's running back. And um, we're on to psychics where we get four dice. So I got six. You got six. All right, my invulnerable save just went to a six because of uh, warp storm, and I got nothing on psychics at all. He denied it, and we're on to shooting. All right, so uh, we we glanced, uh, we penned him and stunned him, but he saved with the corn warp blast, and uh, we killed two plague marines, which is actually pretty good considering their saves. And uh, swinging in here, uh, he's still locked in combat. He fails to kill anything, and he's he's getting glanced to death. And there's another combat. Well, he fails his charge, and we're on to um, round four. 
Did I get any points? That's the question. The movement is done! They're gonna try to kill him. These guys are coming up. He's gonna try to blow, blow this up for a, a victory point. These guys are ostensibly going to charge the Soul Grinder to lock him up, which might work for the entire game, the way these things have gone. And, uh, yeah, we're on to Psychics. Oh, yeah, Psychic points. Five dice. Yep. In shooting, uh, nothing happens. He tried to kill that Harold of Zinch, who's made out of the head of a Keeper of Secrets, but, um, yeah, nothing happens, and so we're on to Assault. So in the, in the assault phase, these spawn finally kill the immobilized soul grinder, and nothing happened in shooting at all. And the other assaults were failures, other than this group of cultists which charged the soul grinder. Let's see what the soul grinder does. He hits three times, and he kills three cultists. And do they run away? It's up to 11 points to my five. He got one point last turn, so we're on to uh, yeah, mine where I, I have to hold objective six pretty much. Yeah, he won, and they're running away, but he can't chase him because he's Nurgle. So we're on to uh, my turn four, where I've got three cards. I can't drop any, and uh, I've got to hold objective six. Darn it. So my movement's done. He's standing an inch away from them. Those guys are there. He's there. This guy is in jump mode there, and we're on to uh, psychics, where there are a total of four dice for me. I killed two guys, lit them on fire, they put it out at the end of the phase, and they have feel no pain at 6+. plus. Warp Storm says 9. Alright, so pretty much Korn just butchered a bunch of cultists with a screaming skull from the warp. We put a, warp, a wound here with the warp blast from the exalted reward, and that thing got penned and uh, it's shaken, it's got one whole point left, and we're on to uh, the assault phase. I won that combat, but lost a gun and took a hull point. And uh, that's it for the assaults. Those guys are running, and how many points did I get? Probably none. All right, he still needs to hold this. He's still winning 11 to 5. It's going to be a crushing victory from chaos to chaos. Those guys are running off the board. This is movement. Guys are there. That guy's there. They got out after immobilizing that rhino. And we're on to psychic phase. And we're on five now. Five psychic powers. Five psychic powers. It's pretty good. I think we're about to seven. Yep, we're all the same. So he's been enfeebled and he's got his force weapon activated. I didn't deny anything. And yeah, we're on to uh, shooting. All right, in the shooting phase, he got glanced. He went to ground, but is unwounded. And uh, those guys ran in the previous phase. They couldn't do much, I guess. And uh, assaults? Yep. Assaults away. No, no, they're not. No. Not an assault vehicle, anyways. Oh, that's right. But they failed their charge. Had it been one. So so far, I've killed a bunch of dudes, but I am enfeebled. The spawn misses. Four no, oh, four attacks. Four attacks. Oh, five for the charge. No, uh, he gets two attacks on the charge because he's got rage. Yeah, uh, hitting me three times. I'm um, weapons go ten. You're not weapons go five. You need fives to hit me. Toughest five. You need fours. Three wounds. Three up armor. Why well, he takes two. But he's still going to win that combat. Two wounds total. We had one beforehand. Yes, yeah, sorry. Yeah, in that combat. All right, the end of combat. What happens? I killed his warlord, and am locked in combat with a friggin' spawn, and um, that's that's it for round five. Do you have any points? No. Thank God. <laughs> it's not looking good for me. I drove up here. He walks to there. This guy's kind of lingering. Bloodthirst is locked in combat. That guy's gone to ground. So Psychic Phase says two dice, so I'm at four. So, so far, Warp Storm was six. This guy failed to do anything on Psychics. And uh, we're on to see what happens. All right, so shooting is done. And uh, I killed, killed a Plague Marine. And we're going to go on to the Assault. So Assault and Assault. There's no way for me to win this so far, but I got six points from his killing his Warlord. And I... I Killed that final combat over there, and these guys are locked. And uh, does the game end? Yes. Boom.